Sister, where are you? Ah, she's coming towards me. Uh, okay, she's gone now. Why are you not reacting, bro? <laughs> Fuck! Hello, and welcome to another indie horror game on the channel. This one is called Fatal Midnight. I'm not entirely sure what it is, to be honest. Um, I downloaded it a few months ago from uh, itch.io, I believe. And we're going to find out together. Yeah, Welcome back to the channel or welcome in if you're new. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you do enjoy. Uh, the like button as well, of course. And I think we have a couple options here. We have sensitivity, which seems fine. Although I'm not in the game yet, so that's just my DPS, never mind. Uh, we have wake up or give up. I might need the give up button eventually, but for now, we're going to wake up and start this nightmare. My parents went on vacation and I was left to look after my sister. She has some problems. Sometimes she is very strange, so I have to look after her. What do you mean by strange, big man? Everything was fine until I heard strange noises in the middle of the night. I'm already not ready for this. Let's find out what these noises were. Jesus Christ, sounds like someone breaking in. Damn, no sounds. My sister is probably feeling bad again. What does that even mean? I have to check on her. Is she a demon? Wow. There's, the view is quite disorienting. Oh, do I have a flashlight? I do not. Okay. Is, does my guy have vertigo? Because he's, he's giving me it. So the door opens towards us. Oh my god, the frames, man, the frames. Yeah, there's no options menu. I don't need to go there. What, is she down the stairs? No. Uh, okay, is her room maybe this way then? What? Which way am I looking? Is her room this way then? There we go. I feel like I've seen this house used in many horror games. That blur effect is... Is my guy okay? I'm pretty sure this is the house and room used in the game, the horror game I, I played before. Where I'm looking from, uh, I'm in my dead sister's like apartment and she's haunting me. They use the same assets. Uh, I didn't see what it said at the bottom of the screen, sorry, I was, I was talking. But she's not in here, guys. Girl power. Yo, this is freaky, man. Okay, we can open that. Nothing in there. Can we open the drawers? What does he mean by feel bad? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just like, oh, you know. It sounds like someone's ripping boards out of the floor. My sister must be feeling bad again. It's like, mate, what are you talking about? That's a creepy uh, little magazine cover there. She, That's a big bath. Is she in the bathroom? She is not. Oh, shit. What the hell happened in here? Okay, we're... What? Okay, I, I'm assuming that's just a bug. I was... I thought the light was flickering, like, behind us in the reflection. Pen and paper, can I take that? Pen and sticky notes? Sister, where are you? This house is big as fuck. Is there only two of us here? He's got a little office here. Okay. Wireless keyboard and mouse. I see you. Little setup. I think I'm... Am I hearing footsteps? That's so blurry in the distance. Go grab your glasses in your room, guy, man. I can't see for shit. All right, let's go downstairs now. What is that noise? What is this someone standing here or is that just a shadow? Hello? God, man. We had pizza for dinner, I see you. Someone was doing their homework. Oh, damn, we had these exact books in school, you know. Green, a uh, little bit of history he was doing. 
little history homework. Green was history, orange was ge geography, blue was RE, yellow was science. Uh, blue might have been English, actually, I can't. Yeah, anyway. Uh, is that someone in the distance there? Um, I'm going to go this way just in case it is, to be honest. This guy, really? Are you that nearsighted? Fucking hell. Hello? What is that? That's definitely someone there. Oh my god, what the fuck are you doing here? Is that your sister, bro? Because I would say she's a bit more than just not feeling good. Uh, is there a peak? A mechanic? There isn't. So that was someone in the distance and she patiently waited for me to uh, look around the house. That's not creepy. Alright, the jump scare is coming. You just don't, I just don't know when. Hello? The fuck? Yo, 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 stop doing that, man. Nah, I'm good, man. I guess I got no choice. You taking a shit in here? Ah, oh, the door closed behind me. Why is the thing flickering? Boo! Oh, did I do that? Oh, you guys need to clean this bathtub, man. Inexcusable. Ah, oh, there she is again. Hello. Sister, is this you? She's probably gone to the basement. I know you don't need to follow her, bro. Do you hear those noises? You do not need to follow her. Oh, God. My character's definitely white, isn't he? White as fuck. Hey sister, it's pitch black. Uh, I'm so sorry. I didn't want to do this, um, but I'm going to come in now. Uh, the light is out. I need to find a flashlight. It's on the second floor near the computer. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to leave you in here. Okay. I'll, I'll come back with my flashlight. Apparently. Okay. Little to do. Oh, in that box, big ass flashlight. You look at that. Let's go. All of a sudden his eyes aren't blurry anymore. Oh, no, he, he he still is. He's, he, his eyes still, still are blurry. Sister, hold tight. I'm coming. I'm going to come into the basement. Look at the state of this place. Uh, shit. Which way was the basement again? Fuck. Oh, it was this, it was this door right here, wasn't it? I still can't see anything. Hello? What's wrong? Why are you upset? Sister, where are you? Ah, she's coming towards me. Uh, okay, she's gone now. Why are you not reacting, bro? <laughs> Fuck! Jesus Christ, man. Fucking fuck was that? There was something clearly wrong with her. I don't think that was her, man. Not as you know her, anyway. Alright. Damn, they nearly killed me. Sitting here. Can we leave the basement now, please? Please let me leave, okay? I don't want to be down here anymore. So we knew that was coming, we just didn't know when. You get me or where. What is that on the ceiling? I like the way the flashlight works in this game, you know? And, oh, okay, just the ceiling's missing. First my sister knocks me out, then the lights go out. Fucking great. Well, it's a good thing I got this industrial sized lantern flashlight. What do I do now? Fucking hell, that's loud, bro. Fuck do you want? Hello? Yo, 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 who's this?
Hey, son, I know what happened to her. Go to your room. Under the bed, there is something that will help you. Oh, God, the AI voice acting is terrible. I need to go to my room. There's something under the bed that will help me. Is it a gun to blow my own head off? Because that's the only way out of this nightmare. Uh, which one was my bedroom again? <laughs> Whoa, okay, not that one. What the fuck? Jesus. Well, wait, no, it's my bedroom, bitch. Get out of my room. Don't do that again, please. She locked me out of my own room, man. Uh, did she open it now? Thank you, man. Damn. Oh, shit. She's on the fucking ceiling. Fucking spider. What the hell? That shit better still be under my bed, man. How do I get it? It's under my bed, dad. I wouldn't mind jumping under there myself at this fucking point. Absolutely torturing me. These bitches. Better not be on my ceiling, man. Move. Oh, wait. Oh, is this box? Is it? She slid it under. Oh, it's a fucking shotgun. I said, is it a gun? Uh, how am I going to shoot a ghost? Jump scare me now, bitch. Where are you? Spider, spider. Okay, now this shit's going to get fun. She's playing the fucking piano. Hey, this view is sick, man. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I hear you. If I see you, I'm gonna put a fucking slug into you. Yeah, I can hear her too, but how can she be playing the piano and running around? My dad just gave me permission to blow my sister's fucking head off with a shotgun. Do these bullets contain holy water? How are we gonna get her? I hear you. I feel like I'm playing ready or not now. If you're in this room, you're dead. Where are you? You fucking bitch! Wait, what? Man said terrorists win. However, shortly after this fatal midnight, the police arrive on the scene and arrest Daniel. What? As it turns out, he has a mental disability and is taking pills. This led to the tragic incident. This tune is fire though. In reality, the sister was trying to get away from her brother by hiding from him to preserve her life. The sister was not possessed by demons, it was all Daniel's fantasy. Neighbours who heard her screams and gunshots impatiently called the police, hoping to help the unfortunate girl, but there was no way to save her. The girl was shot with a shotgun. With perfect accuracy, I might add, Daniel was put in a mental hospital, and there he realises what had happened. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was Fatal Midnight. That was pretty sick, man. I enjoyed, thoroughly enjoyed that. That part when I got the shotgun was pretty fun. The rest of it was kind of traumatizing. Uh, but it's crazy that we were in a mental, like a psychotic break. And she was running around. She was trying to hide from us. That's probably why she jumped in the basement as well. And hit me with something when I came in because I was probably trying to kill her. That's insane. We're the villain the whole time. Some sixth sense type shit, but not really because we're not dead the whole time. But our sister is now. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Um, but I think that's enough from me now. Until next time, as always, I love you all and bye-bye.